Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is my go-to look to feel glamorous. Now I could be sitting around the house in my pajamas but as long as I've got on a bold lip and lots of lashes, I'm gonna feel glamorous. I could probably even wear this look with a potato sack and still feel glamorous. To me, makeup is a way to express myself and my style. So for today's video, I've actually teamed up with Westfield to let you guys know about their Today I Am Beautiful campaign. Basically, the campaign's about being confident and embracing who you are, whilst using beauty and fashion as forms of self-expression. Westfield are having a four-day beauty festival from the 15th to the 18th of October all across Australia, and there's going to be stuff like hair, makeup, grooming, and wellness masterclasses. There's going to be demonstrations from beauty experts, in-store styling sessions, and beauty workshops, and also a Appearances from Lara Worthington, David Gandhi. For those of you who don't know, he's a male model. <laughs> and Max May, as well as lots of free samples and gift with purchases. And who doesn't love free stuff? So it's going to be an awesome, awesome event. I'll have a link in the description box where you guys can go check out everything going on. And now we can get onto the tutorial because today I am glamorous. I've already started off by priming my eyes with the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer and Rimmel's Match Perfection Powder. <laughs> so now I can go in with eyeshadow. The eyeshadows I'm using are from the Too Faced Natural Eyes palette, which you guys can get at Mecca Maxima. And Mecca Maxima are actually having some really cool events on throughout the beauty festival, so you guys should definitely check those out if you're interested. Anyway, I'm just taking the shade Nudie and blending this into my crease as my transition shade. Then I'm going in with Cashmere Bunny and packing this on all over my lid. Next up, I'm taking the shade Erotica. <laughs> These are some interesting eyeshadow names. <laughs> And I'm going to pack this on to the outer third of my eyelid. And to darken up my crease, I'm going in with Sexpresso <laughs> and blending this in with the usual windscreen wiper motions. To brighten up my eyes, I'm going in with Silk Teddy. First, I'm packing this onto my inner V with a pencil brush so that I have more precision. Then I'm going to switch to a flat shader brush to highlight my brow bone. Next up, I'm going to use the Maybelline Gel Liner to draw on a wing, and obviously I'm using some sticky tape as a guide. I say this every time, but seriously guys, using tape is a game changer. Then I'm just going to apply a few coats of mascara before adding some false lashes. Now we can take off the sticky tape and move on to our face. So I'm going straight in with foundation today, and I'm going to use L'Oreal True Match, my favourite. <laughs> For concealer, I'm using the same Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer from before. And just so you guys know, all the drugstore products I'm using today are available from Priceline. Priceline are also hosting events at the Beauty Festival and they're probably the events I'm most excited for because Priceline is pretty much my second home. Seriously, if I'm not at home or somewhere that involves food, I'm at Priceline. Then to set my face, I'm using the Rimmel Match Perfection Powder. Moving on to eyebrows, I'm going to quickly fill mine in with the Rimmel Born No Brow This Way. Ah, clever. <laughs> brow powder in dark brown. I did go a little bold with my brows today, but sometimes bold brows are just part of life. Next, I'm taking the Master Sculpt Powder by Maybelline, and I'm going to use this to contour my cheekbones, jaw, and forehead. Then I'm going to grab this blush by Bourjois and pop it onto my cheeks for a bit of colour. Now we can go back to our eyes. So I'm just going to smudge Cashmere Bunny into my lower lash line with a pencil brush. Then I'm going back in with Silk Teddy to brighten up my inner V. Then to finish our eyes, I'm adding a coat of the Dior Show Iconic Overcurl Mascara. I decided the CoverGirl one I used before wasn't giving me enough volume, so I'm going over the top of it with this one. Also, Dior's another brand hosting events at the festival. I believe they're having an interactive workshop, but there are so many different events on. It's going to be huge, guys. So onto lips, I'm lining them with a red lip liner by Bourjois first because my hands are not steady when it comes to lipstick, so this just makes everything look a whole lot cleaner. Then for lipstick, I'm using the Rimmel Provocalypse lip colour in the shade Kiss Me You Fool. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know what that was. Okay. <laughs> 
So this is my glamorous look. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial and I would love to see what looks you guys have been feeling lately, whether you're feeling fierce or natural. I'd love to see them on Facebook, Instagram or Twitter. Just use the hashtag todayiam so I can check them out. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!